We are very excited to introduce you to the newest four-legged member <laughs> of our 12 News family. He is adorably cute and furry and goes by the simple name of Hank. This adorable little guy belongs to our sweet Lindsay and her husband, Sean. So good to see you guys and congratulations on your new furry baby. Thank you very oh, much. We, we just got him on Monday and uh, this week has been about uh, trying to crate train him, potty train him a little bit, but he's seven weeks, nine pounds. His dad is 93, so this dog is gonna grow a lot quickly. Oh, he is so adorable and Lindsay, um, should I just be honest with our viewers? You haven't been sleeping very much. I have you? not been sleeping, <laughs> but this is a really good reason not to sleep. Yes. And you know what? I mean, I'm going to show off his ears because... Okay, that's my favorite part about him. I mean, these are some floppy ears here. He's big. And we just little. cannot wait to get him out and mm -hmm. all around Arizona. So uh, tomorrow we're going on a photo shoot around Arizona in the high country. And... Uh, He's a cutie, but um, and this is your second dog. This is my second dog. I had we had a lab yeah. previous who was 12 years old. We were dogless for about a year and a half, and now we just got Hank this week. So uh, he's actually shaking right now. <laughs> I'm nervous to be on TV. He I don't is know. yes. And this is, I mean, this kind of breed is what you've been wanting forever. It sure is, yes. Um, I've actually always wanted a bloodhound, and this is part bloodhound and part um, foxhound. That's what uh, this breed is. So uh, he's a black and tan, and uh, so he will get to be about 93 pounds one day, and oh uh, we are very excited as he gets bigger. Uh, to show him all of Arizona. We are avid hikers. That's yes. what we do on the weekend. So uh, we are just going to get out on the trails and go to different dog friendly patio restaurants and uh, take in all the sights with our new fur baby. Okay, and I always get a kick out of dog names that are human names. So how did you come up with the name of Hank? How did we come up with the name Hank, babe? <laughs> just something majestic and. <laughs> I mean, I'm a big baseball fan, so I like Hank Aaron, so that's where it came Oh, so, from Sean, it was your idea. Well, I did look up hound names on Google and read a bunch of lists, okay. and this is what we came up with, and Sean, my husband, loved the name, too, <laughs> because of baseball, so. Hank the Hound. We went with it. Yeah, it's got a great ring to it. It does, yes. Oh, well, congratulations. Thank you. I know what it's like to just welcome some furry love. It's so, so adorable. Thank we you, love Graham. Hank. I hope that uh, maybe we could bring Hank around more often. We're going to try to bring Hank around more often. Yeah, that's a, little, that's a little something to do with George, our news director. Yes. Uh, hopefully he's watching, too. <laughs> Hank is so cute. Okay, So um, thank you so much for bringing him in. Sean, thanks for making the extra trip here. It's good to see you, my friend. Yeah, yes. nice to wow. see you. <laughs> hey, since we are talking about dogs, we had to share the love too a little bit, right? This is my little fur baby, Presley. She always goes on hiking trips with us as well, especially camping. In fact, uh, we're hitting the road after this to go up to Cottonwood and she is in the back of the RV. Okay, so we can't forget about our Mark Curtis who has, look at that family. I mean, so in this picture, there's three dogs. We have Jackie, Brody, and Millie. And by the way, Brody is actually Mark's daughter's dog. So adorable. Look at that happy family.